What's going on boys? Welcome back to another video. So today is going to be a Call of Duty Mobile video. I did say I was going to release more Call of Duty Mobile videos. I'm still going to be making Creative Destruction ones, but today is going to be a Call of Duty Mobile one. So basically, um, I'm going to go over some of the uh, details as in like the global release date, some leaked stuff I found on Call of Duty Mobile. So yeah, make sure you hit that subscribe button and enjoy the video. Yeah boy! So here we go guys, this is the uh, main um, login screen for Call of Duty Legends of War Mobile. Now as you can see at the moment, um, basically Call of Duty Mobile, they released a beta only in Australia. Uh, around two to four weeks ago. Um, I didn't actually get a chance to play that beta. Um, I just missed out on it, but um, a lot of other people did. So I'm going to be using some other people's content today, um, especially someone called Kamikaze Gaming on YouTube. So I'm going to put his link in the description because he's given me some uh, gameplay footage of um, some Call of Duty stuff that he played in the beta. So go and subscribe to him in the description and uh, give him a thumbs up. So yeah, this is a loading screen at the moment, basically, guys. I tried using a VPN to get into the Australia version. But um, as the beta's closed now, um, that's the end of the beta. So if I try and log in now as a guest, it'll say guest login, join lobby, connection terminated. So the uh, they're totally closed at the moment. Um, yeah, I can't actually do anything uh, to log into the game. So basically, from what I've heard on the Call of Duty Discord server and other various um, links that i found as well, basically... Um, the global release date isn't going to be until around April, May time. So they're going to be releasing um, it in China on the 30th of March, the end of this month. So I'm going to be able to play it then um, on the uh, Chinese servers. But global release isn't going to be around until around April and May time. So we've got a bit of a wait. But guys, I'm going to keep getting videos out just to show you all of the leaked stuff that I found. Um, and we're gonna go from there. Okay guys, so here are some of the leaks I've actually found in Call of Duty Mobile. So we're gonna go through each one of them just to see um, exactly what they're all about and see what we have to uh, we have to come in Call of Duty Mobile. So uh, first we're gonna go into zombie mode. Now we've got a few pictures here um, which look pretty cool. It looks like the main zombie mode map uh, is going to be called Green Run. Um, I do have some gameplay footage which I'm going to show you in a second as well about this but we're just going to slowly go through these pictures um, and kind of explain each one. So we've got normal, hard and hell mode uh, for zombies um, and as you can see there you can gain possible rewards such as weapons and it looks like sort of, um, I don't know, mutations it looks here, increases zombie HP but decreases zombie movement speeds. So there's going to be a lot of different perks and stuff. I'm not going to go into too much detail, I'll save that for future videos but... Yeah, I'm just going through kind of each of these pictures to show you exactly what's to come in the zombie mode of um, Call of Duty. So let's go and check out uh, game modes and maps. So here, guys, we have um, all of the uh, the game modes that are going to be on here. So we've got Frontline, kill players from the opposing team. You always spawn at your base. The first team to reach the score limit wins. Uh, team Deathmatch, which you already know what that is. Search and destroy, um, search and, uh, defend and destroy the objective, no respawning, and free for all. Straight up deathmatch, every man and woman for his or herself. So there are four game modes, guys. Frontline, team deathmatch, and uh, search and destroy, and free for all. So there's not too many, but that's, that's pretty cool. It looks like here, guys, we have the maps. We've got four different maps. So we've got Crossfire. We've got Nuketown, which a lot of you guys will know. We have Crash. And we also have Kill House as well. So we've got four different maps, guys, and four different game modes. Um, they may add more. Oh, sorry, we have six different game modes. We have Standoff and uh, high, uh, Standoff and Crash as well. So yeah, there's six different um, maps, guys. My apologies, six different maps um, and four different game modes. So there's a lot to take in. Um, I'm not going to go through the guns in, in too much detail, there's, there's, there's over 30 guns in the game guys, we've got so many different guns, we've got a UR-736, Arctic-50, 
There are a lot of different guns, so it's going to take a while to go through all of these. I'm, I'm going to go through each one in a separate video just to show you a, uh, an overlay, but this is kind of just a teaser of some of the guns to come in Call of Duty Mobile. Uh, we also have kill strikes here, so it's only going to show a few of them in the leaked, uh, leaked images. We've got a UAV, uh, a hunter killer, a counter UAV, the predator missile, a sentry gun. Yeah, there's a lot of different kill streaks as well, so... It's going to be exactly the same as Call of Duty on, on every other kind of platform, but it's, it's not going to be as much. So, um, we also have a story mode, it looks like, here. So, I mean, maybe it's going to be like the old school Call of Duties, where it's going to be a story, a multiplayer, and maybe a battle royale. I mean, with the battle royale being huge at the moment, there could be a, could be a battle royale mode. I wouldn't be surprised. So we have here farm, diner, and bus, de bus depot. Um, these look like the zombie stories. It says zombie story just under them. So, I mean, these could just be the zombie um, maps. So, I mean, that's good. Three zombie maps in one game. Uh, we've got a lot of weapon skins as well. Like I said, guys, I'm going to go through this in a lot more detail in future videos. But that's just a little teaser of, uh, of the weapon skins that are going to be coming in Call of Duty Mobile. Um, let's have a look at what else we have. We also have characters as well. There's going to be a few different characters. Now, these look pretty cool. These look really cool. We've got a Merc 5, Merc 4. We have an Agent 2, a Soldier 1, Soldier 3, Soldier 5. So, I'm not sure if you can um, edit the skins of, uh, of the actual um, members. It looks like they come standard as they are, but there are quite a few different ones. So you've got a lot to choose from, um, as you can see there. So there's not going to be too many um, too many skins. Uh, but yeah, that's, uh, that's, that's really cool. We've also got leveling, guys. So you can, you can level through the ranks as well. So... As you can see there, level 28, 29, 30, and you obviously claim, um, it looks like Call of Duty coins for doing that, which you can purchase, I'm guessing, skins, etc. So, that's awesome. We've got um, perks as well, so you can add perks um, to your characters. Scavenger, scavenger, able to recover ammo every six seconds while not in combat. So there's a lot of different perks. So, for you guys that have played Call of Duty before... Um, this is basically the the old school Call of Duties on mobile, so it's going to be amazing. Uh, and there's not really a lot else to show you guys, so uh, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to stop talking because I've blabbered on for ages now, and I'm just going to show you some uh, videos that I've um, I've gotten from uh, some other content creators. Like I said, uh, Kamikaze Gaming has helped me out with some with some content because he played the beta, so make sure you go sub to his channel. His link is in the description, and um, yeah, let's uh, let's let's check out some some Call of Duty mobile clips. Here we go.
经典爆破模式。回合开始时，进攻方携带一颗炸药，需抵达地图上两个目标点之一进行安放，并等待炸药引爆摧毁目标。防守方则是要阻止进攻方安放炸药。回合内双方阵亡后都无法重生，所以防守方需要击败所有进攻方人员，或者拆除炸药，才可获得胜利。休闲爆破模式，游戏规则与经典爆破模式一样，但不一样的是，这个模式中的连续得分奖励在回合间不会被清空，并且可以使用士兵技能，休闲趣味更刺激。据点争夺模式，游戏开始时，双方阵营从地图两端各自的出生点出生，玩家阵亡后。从距离已占领点位或队友位置较近的出生点重生，已经占领的点位会给占领方不断补血分数。在规定时间内，一方阵营积累到目标分数后获胜。个人竞技模式：游戏开始时，所有玩家分别出生在地图的随机区域，每个人通过击败其他对手获得积分。当玩家被击败后，从距离其他玩家最远的位置重生。在规定时间内。先达到目标分数的玩家获得第一名，其他玩家按分数高低排位。冲锋团队竞技，游戏开始时，双方阵营从地图两端各自出生点出生，阵亡后依然从各自阵营出生点重生。双方通过击败敌人获得积分，在规定时间内累计达到目标分数的队伍获得胜利。战术团队竞技。游戏开始时，双方阵营从地图两端各自出生点出生。与冲锋团队竞技不一样的是，阵亡后，玩家会从距离队友较近的位置重生，通过击败敌人获得积分，在规定时间内累计达到目标分数的队伍获得胜利。不同的模式都有不一样的玩法和策略，需要你的智慧和队友默契配合的战术，才能获得战斗的胜利。So that's what I have so far on Call of Duty Mobile, guys. So I hope you've enjoyed all this content. Uh, it's all the stuff I found. Um, again, make sure you press that subscribe button. I'm going to be bringing out more and more content about Call of Duty Mobile, more in-depth stuff. Um, so look out for that. Make sure you hit a thumbs up on the video. And uh, yeah, let me know in the comments exactly what you think. Yeah, boy! Gila.